are right now to the expert level that you wish to be so it is very important for you to practice it is very easy to watch a teacher go through the process but when you start doing it yourself you will see that some you know some very stubborn mistakes and from some very stubborn errors will start popping up that you will start detecting on your own and you will see that oh okay because now the process of struggling through those errors that is the real learning process right just watching of tutorials or following of lectures is not enough to um to earn you the skill that you need so it is very important remember what i always told you guys we are in the skilled era all right gonna those days that when you just have a certificate someone will give you a job it is not so anymore do you understand we have a third class student doing a lot better than a first class student because of skill set so um remember you really really have to practice it is very very important for you to practice so i'm going to be starting up my local wp right now i already start up my local wp and i'm going to be starting uh, you know my website remember when you want to start when you want to start working you need to load up your local wp all right so i'm going to be sharing my screen now you need to load up your local wp and then after you load up your local wp uh, you need to click on start site all right load up your local wp and click on start site after you click on start site then you can just click on wp admin all right when you click on wp admin it will open your administrative panel but the thing is that the first time you open it when you open it for the first time it might take a while before it loads up so just give it just rest the case and leave it alone and allow it to do its thing all right it's actually my fault that everyone is late today so i mean lagos is so unpredictable i got caught in traffic so um i guess i have to apologize for that i'm sorry okay very good so we are starting right away um the website is still loading up the website the website is still loading up so far so good we've really achieved a lot in this class we've achieved quite a lot and i'm very proud of how far we've gone all right i'm so super proud of how far we've gone because we've really really achieved a lot of stuff we've been able to uh this is where we oh yeah there's something that i want us to undo really quick i want us to undo something really fast and really quick right now right now if you click on visit site and you visit your website you will notice something very weird if you go to visit your website when you click on this home page button and you click on visit site or you left click and open in another tab right if you click on visit a site you will see that it is still you know it will not take you to the home page that we were designing yesterday right it will not take you to the home page that we were designing yesterday if you go to pages if you go to pages all right if you go to pages let me show you that if you go to pages i'll try as much as possible to make this class not to be too long under about 40 minutes we should be done with this class because i'm very tired i was actually thinking of postponing this class but i don't want to do that right i don't want to postpone this class so um let's just uh let's just get it over with we have a couple we have a couple of pages here we have about us page contact us page home page home page is what we were designing yesterday remember we were designing home page yesterday that was what we were designing yesterday right uh-huh that's what we were designing yesterday that's the home page you know we call it home we have the products page services page and so on and so forth do you understand now when you click on it when you go to your website.com or the root menu of your website all right if i go to nova university.com nova university.co it should redirect me to a certain page do you understand this is the page that i have designed to be my own page I have several other pages on this website as well, several other pages, but this is a page that I've designed to be my own page, right? Do you understand? Now, what we want to do is to make sure that, is to make sure that when we go to localhost.com or whatever your website name.com is, we want to make sure it lands on this page that we call home, right? We want to make sure it lands on this page that we call home. Alright, I hope you understand what I'm saying. 
Now, if I show you, if I show you the back end of Nova University, right? Let me just show you this real quick. If I show you the back end of Nova University, and I go to pages, and I go to all pages, if I go to all pages, you are going to see I have a lot. I have a whole lot of pages here. I have a page called Activate All Courses, Attendance, Attendance Success. I have Become a Teacher, Blog, Card, Certification. These are pages that you can go to. This is your attendance page. This is the page that we are using for attendance. This is your attendance success page. This is your attendance page. Do you understand? But I also, out of all these pages that you see, I also have a page called Home. And I have set it to be my front page. I could as well have set this particular page called Document as my front page. It means when you go to NovaUniversity.co, when you go to NovaUniversity.co, you are going to be landing on that Document page instead of the Home page. So what we want to do right now for our website, now this is our website that we are creating, we want to set this particular page. For the fact that you name it home, does not mean it's going to be your home page. It does not mean it is where all traffic will be directed to. We have to specially set it as our home page. As I have done for this one, and that is why it has, after it is called home, it has something else that is called front page. Front page means your the root menu of your of your the, the root of your website that is the page it is pointing to i hope you understand what i just explained right now okay so what we are going to do is that we are going to come to customize all right so when you come here remember our customize the customizer that we used yesterday open your customizer i hope you guys are following me are you guys following me if you are following me come to the chat section and say i follow come to the chat section and say i follow Is no one following me? Very good. Now, we just opened our customizer. We just opened our customizer. And then after we open our customizer, there is a section there. You know, we have site identity, we've explored site identity menu, widgets, home page, typography, um, general options, and all that stuff. Now, you go to home page settings. See home page settings. Home page settings. Click on home page settings. And it will say, your home page displays what? Click on static page. Click on static page. After you click on static page, you are going to see more options that say home page or post page. So, home page select on that drop down of home page select this page called home just select this page called home and then go ahead and publish do you see that let me go over that again let me go over that again um let me go over that again home page settings static page then on that home page select home you can see immediately after i selected home it has rerouted us to the home page that we are working with so you can exit your customizer. I hope that is so, 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 you know, um, it's very simple enough for you to understand. So you can now see that when you go to your website root menu, it is redirecting you to your home page here. Do you understand? And when you click on home here, it is taking you to the home page right here. So it is that simple. It is very simple. And if you go to all pages now, if you go to all pages right now, you are going to see you are going to see that your home page now has something in front that says front page. Do you understand? If I had selected this contact us, if I had selected this contact us under the customizer, it is this contact us that we have front page. So you should understand that by now. So that is very, very simple. So in order to continue with what we were doing, I will click on, let's open this page. Let's edit this page. And let's open it with Elementor. edit this page and open with Elementor all right just click on edit with Elementor so it is opening I think someone was complaining to me that their Elementor is not opening who is that person someone sent me a DM today that um, Elementor is not opening I, I don't know who that person is if you are having that issue just connect to internet reload the page there's really no big deal maybe probably something is blocking it 
um, you know, it will work out. Do you understand? It will eventually work out. So this is what we have, right? This is what we have right now. And um, I'm just going to show you the general. Let me open Eden's Digital's website. Eden's Digital slash. Uh, I want to open the website we are modeling after. All right, so this is the website we are modeling after. We've already created, we've already created this part of the website, right? We've created this part of the website. Now let us create this part of the website. All right, let us create this section of the website. Do you understand? Let's create this section of the website. This is what we want to create right now. Stay with me, everyone. So again, remember, we are going to click on the plus icon, right? Click on the plus icon. All right, click, click on the plus icon to get a section, a full section. Now, the first thing we need is space at the top and space at the bottom. Space at the top, space at the bottom. So what we are going to do is we are going to go to the settings panel of this section. We are going to go to advanced and we are going to give it padding top of maybe 100 pixels. 100 is too much. Let's say 70 and padding bottom of 70 as well. You can see I already spaced it. So if I put any contents inside it now, you will see that there is space at the top, there is space at the bottom. This heading, we are already in the settings panel of this heading. Double click on the pencil button of this heading to get to the settings panel. So you can change it to Y uh, Toads link, right? You can see Y Toads link. This is what we have here. And I'm going to go ahead and centralize it I'll go ahead and change it to color black, right? I'll go ahead and change it to poppins because you know you have to be consistent with the font you are using. All right, so we use poppins for this particular one, so I want us to use poppins for this one too. Do you understand? So that everything will be uniform, right? So you, so you come here and let us give it a font size of let's say uh, 25, font size of 25 and yeah i think we are good to go so after that we have a little bit of um after that we have a little bit of um you know text here so what we are going to do what we are going to do is to um add a little bit of um, you know, of text editor here all right and then we are going to centralize that text editor and um, how many paragraphs okay it is just a few words let me delete some of these words do you see how i'm designing it one after the other if you are a graphic designer this should be very very easy for you to grasp because you already understand the concept of design if you are not a graphic designer it's very simple for you to grasp it there's nothing hard there you can see this is what we just did this section of it this section of the demo website that we are creating can you see that guess what we need next we need three column section one two three is that right we need a three column section one two three do you understand now there are two ways we can do this we could just click on this and take another three column section right one two three and start building something else inside do you understand and start putting stops inside right and start putting stops inside like this do you understand we can do that or there's another option that they've given us that elemental gives us called inner section it is called inner section it means it's a it's a child section that can sit inside the mother section this is a mother section right it has it has all the characteristics of a normal section it has all the characteristics of a normal section it has all the characteristics of a normal section, but it can sit inside a child section. All right, it can sit inside in a, a child section. Can you see? So it's a section on its own. It's a section on its own, right? But then it is sitting inside a, a, a mother section, a bigger section. Do you understand? So it is this one that I'm going. I'm, I'm just going to add one more column. I'm going to left click on one of these column, or I'm just going to left click on it. Uh, do you understand? Oh, sorry, I'm going to left click on one of these columns inside of it and I'm going to add new column. 
all right so we now have three column one two three we have three column now do you see that it's very very easy it's very very easy do you understand all you just have to do is to drag in an inner section all right click on one of the you know one of the sections and it's either you dupli duplicate or add new column all right this is, this is very easy just add new column and you have a three column section one two and three so let me remove this second one now what we need to do if we want to create something like this there is there is an element that we call icon box search for an element called icon box are you guys following me i hope you are still following me i hope you can see me and you can hear me loud and clear i hope you can hear me loud and clear and you can see me so exclusive from uh, please give me a while i'm happy to call once was a ship that put to sea the name of the ship was a bully of tea the wind blew up her bird hello yeah good evening okay okay sir All right, guys. Um, I'm so sorry about that. Um, I was actually going to ask the person to call me back that was that I was in a meeting, but guess what? It's a potential client. The person saw uh, one of my advertisement on Facebook, and he wants to create a website, a mobile application, and um, a video, a video to promote it. So he wants to um, he wants a combination of website, a mobile application, and a video. Do you understand? And uh, <laughs> that would be a lot of money. Do you understand? I, I want you to conceptualize the kind of money that he will be paying me like that. So um, I'm going to have a meeting with him tomorrow. I'm probably going to have him drive down to my office or maybe I will drive down to go and meet him wherever he is. And then we're going to have a meeting to discuss whatever it is he wants to create. And then we we'll charge him accordingly. Um, so, yeah. And um, this can be you. This can be you too very soon. All you have to do is position yourself, right? Uh, imagine, I'm just sitting here. I did not go out. I'm right here in my house, and I'm receiving calls for project. I'm receiving calls for project. And that is because my advertisement is currently showing on Facebook. My advertisement is currently showing on Google. 
and then people that need that, that service will see me and they will come to me. I don't have to struggle. Do you understand? Um, it, it is one thing to be hard working, it is another to be smart working. Right? Instead of working hard and struggling to get clients, all you have to do is to allow, uh, you know, just put in an automatic funnel out there that will just drive, you know, that will just massively drive those traffic to you. Uh, do you understand? So, yeah, that is it. And I'm hoping that um, that is what you will be able to learn from me. Um, you know, that is what you'll be able to learn from me and you'll be able to do the same for yourself as well. And uh, some of you that you've gotten into the mentorship group, I just want to congratulate you. Your journey with me just starts. Uh, we're still going to do a lot of very, very good stuff together. All right. And you guys are very, very lucky because what others, what they get for 50,000 era, um, thanks to Union Bank, you are getting it at 10,000 era, which is, which is so, so, so beautiful. All right. And, and I hope that in the next one month, two months, we are going to, in fact, you are going to be a testimony and I'm going to be telling your testimony to the next batches of, um, you know, of next, next batches of free web design classes that we are going to do by God's grace. All right. So, yeah, um, let's continue. Uh, let's continue. Um, so this is where we are. Can you see that? I've already created this and I've created this. Uh, mm -hmm. The next thing I'm going to do right now is to put icon box. Do you understand? I was talking about icon box. So just drag in icon box, drag it inside one of these three columns. Do you understand? So after I've... Are you guys following me or am I talking to myself? Are you following me? Okay, very good. Um, Emmanuel said he has not been added to the mentorship group. Well, for you to be added to the WhatsApp mentorship group, you need to finish your online course. After you are done with your online course, that is when you are going to join the group. Do you understand? I explained that yesterday. Okay. Now, from here, I've already, I've already added this icon box. So, um, you can scroll down and icon position, under icon position, just change it to this left. Change it to left. So when you change it to left, you can see that, sorry, change it to left, you can see that it is looking like this already. Alright? The next thing that I need to do is to change this icon. Go to icon library. There are tons and tons and tons and tons of icons there. Do you understand? But it is this one that we are looking for, box. We are looking for a box. Just search for box. You can see open box. Select box. And then you can see we have it already. So just go ahead. What is this saying? It's saying pick up and delivery. Um, it is saying pick up and delivery. So let's just write. Um, type two is pick up and delivery. And uh, okay, type two is pick up and delivery. So let's go to style. You can increase the spacing between the icon and the content, or you can reduce the spacing. You can increase the spacing. So let's space it like this. And you can change the icon color to red. We have red here. Can you see? We have red here. All right, you can change the icon color to red. And uh, you can reduce the size of the icon. You can reduce the size of the icon because the size here is not too big. And you can change the color, color of the text under content, under content. Change the color of the text to, to red. Alright, change the color of the text to, to red. And change the font size to poppings as well. I'm sorry. Change the font size to poppings. Change it to poppings as well. And um, yeah. So the spacing, this spacing on that title is the spacing between the, you know, this contents and the heading. So just reduce the spacing a little bit. Okay, very good. And maybe you want to, and maybe you want to reduce this content. This content is too much. Maybe you want to reduce this content like this. Fine. Can you see that? Can you see that? We just created this, this particular one. And guess what? All these other ones, one, two, three, four, five, six, they are the same design as this one. So I don't have to remake all this thing again. What I just need to do is to click on this one 
click on this and right click on it and go ahead and copy it so after i copy it i can come to this other place this other column and paste it i can come to this other column and paste it as well do you understand and i can take this entire thing all right i can take, take this entire guy this entire um inner section i can just duplicate it do you understand i can just duplicate it and this second inner section that i just duplicated let me give it a little bit of spacing at the top let me just give it um you know i just clicked on this inner section here and i went to the advanced settings and i gave it um you know upper margin of let's say 30 of 30 pixels all right so just as this one and yeah i have it so you can now go ahead and customize this instead of having pick up delivery i'm oh, sorry instead of having pick up delivery it is um, fast citywide delivery uh, so change this one to fast citywide delivery and you want to change it to whatever this is uh, i think that is a location marker location it's a location marker right and then maybe you want to change this one to, to whatever that is all right uh, skewed bikers all right uh, skewed bikers and you want to change this to the picture of a bike you want to change this to picture of a bike and so on and so forth you understand it you, you get the trick so i'm not going to go ahead and be doing all these things you get it you, you can fill in the gap by yourself this is something you can do do you understand but the, the whole concept of the design is is the same do you understand the whole concept of the design is the same and immediately after you are done with this click, click another section all right we want to create the next section the next section this particular section here and this particular section here that's what we want to create very simple as well it's a two column section instead of taking one take two column section it's a two column section as usual give it padding top and padding, padding bottom padding top is uh give it padding top of let's say like 70 padding bottom of about 70 as well for uniformity and um here here we have adding and we have you know a little bit of text so we already have an adding here that we've already customized just copy this adding copy this adding and come and paste it here just paste it here all right but you have to left align it and you have to change this to about us the reason why i'm doing this is for uniformity this text style has to be equal to this text style do you understand you know just for uniformity in your design so you can come over here and take another um you know text editor put another text editor that is for this text that is here all right Literally after we are done with that we need to build these guys but guess what these guys looks exactly like these guys that we designed here so we don't have to design it again all we just have to do is to copy and paste it inside do you, are you guys getting this do, do you are you getting this do you see how simple it is are you following me do you see how is it simple or not do you see how simple it is talk to me in the chat section exactly so we can go ahead we can go ahead and put in an inner section we need an inner section here actually we need an inner section here so put in an inner section here all right and the inner section has to be two column because we have two column column one column two do you understand just go ahead and copy one of these guys copy one of these guys and paste it inside this inner section right but then we need to minimize stuff we need to reduce the sizes and all come to settings reduce the spacing reduce the size of the icon come to contents uh reduce the size reduce the size of the you know of the adding because i mean all these things is scaled down they are different and instead of red it is black change it to black right and um this content to this description reduce the size of the description as well 
reduce the size of the description maybe reduce the spacing between them maybe reduce the spacing between them and maybe the length maybe the length of the you know maybe the length of the text to reduce it as well fine and you see we have it already so again instead of redesigning it just copy it and paste here all right paste it here and after you paste it here just duplicate this old guy duplicate this old guy and after you duplicate this old guy as we have done before give this um a top margin of about let's say 30. no 30 is too much maybe 20. okay 20 is pretty cool 20 is very good and then the last thing we need is a button yeah we need a button a button that says work with us someone is trying to join but guess what again we have created a button that looks exactly like that here we can just copy this particular button here we can just copy this particular button here and paste it and just paste it here just paste it here like this do you understand can you see but we need to left align it and uh, we need to we need to change it to work with us work with us and we need to give it space top margin of let's say we need to change it to top margin of let's say 50 no 50 is too much 40 or 30 30 is okay can you see it's already looking like this it's already looking like this but maybe probably you want to change the icons i mean i don't need to do that for you you know how to go ahead and change the icons to maybe um you know you know whatever it is you want to change the icon to all right so you can change the icon to whatever you want to change it to and change the content so you can do that and this other place has an image it has an image of a bike guy do you understand i don't think i have this image but let, let me get on google uh delivery bike illustration all right delivery bike illustration and there are a lot of delivery bike bike illustration that you can download perhaps let's download this guy let's download this one all right let's download this particular one it is still loading all right it is still loading so you can download this you can save it or even if you want to if you want to make things a little bit interesting if you want to make a little bit interesting you can download a gif image a moving image a gif image delivery bike illustration gif all right delivery bike illustration gif if you download a gif image it means the image will be moving just make sure it has um you know uh a, a white background can you see this image is moving can you see that this image is moving let me just download it it will give your website an extra frosting and people will think it is magic that you are doing it's not magic it's just the image that is moving so instead of having just a pure image now this is the image widget move the image widget in uh, we'll just go ahead and open it and we upload that gif image that we downloaded all right if we upload that GIF image that we downloaded it is still uploading then after it is done uploading then we go ahead but maybe you don't want to upload it like this you might want to compress it first you can see it's 900 and something kilobytes which is bad i'm telling you whatever image you are going to upload on your website the maximum allowable um file size that i'm giving you is 200 kilobytes it must not be more than 200 kilobytes if it is more than 200 kilobytes it's either you go and compress it or you don't use it at all do you understand 200 kilobytes it's a commandment that i'm giving you if you don't want your website to be as slow as hell so just go ahead and insert this one so because this is for experimental purpose we can use this one can you now see can you see how beautiful it looks it looks as if we have something that is moving can you see this guy is actually moving he's actually moving you know can you see what we have just three days just just four days of lecture see what i have been able to teach you if this is all you can create people will be willing to pay you but uh, there is something there's something guys check this out this particular one has a little bit of a gray background it has a little bit of a gray background it is not completely white so let us change that all right let us change that let's go ahead and uh, and then set the background set the background color for this section 
all right set the background color for this section and instead of getting changing it twice let's give it a little bit of gray like this a little bit of gray like this all right you see that aha let's check that again let's check that again can you see that that's better that's better so i guess you should have gotten the whole idea of um, you know should have gotten the whole the, the whole idea of designing your website and making everything look good you so the idea should have been very very clear to you. you should have gotten the whole idea so this is what we have right now let us preview our website and be happy let us preview our website and be so super happy all right now this is what we have are you not proud of yourself are you not proud of yourself this is what you can create now if you think this is amazing and if you think this is awesome just come to the chat section and type thank you nova university because obviously we are done we are done with this class actually we are done with this class because you know you should be able to create this pricing section by yourself you should be able to create this pricing section by yourself right actually if you want to create this pricing section uh this pricing widget on elementor is not free you have to purchase Elementor Pro, you know, uh, pricing, you know, this is the price list or price table, price list, price table, this is the price table plugin, but it is not free, do you understand, but guess what, we can build our own price table, you know, you can build your own price table, let me show you, if you, if you, you know, you can build your own price table, uh, let's say 100 pixel, 100 pixel, then you can you know maybe put a title here maybe put um, you know maybe put a big title and put another title title that say price and then another title duplicate this particular one that says uh, maybe 56 56 dollars and then you can change this one to maybe black and you can make it bigger and you can make this one uh, you know you can make this one to maybe not too black maybe like this right and you can continue building your price list like that you can put a button all right you can put a button and you know make it justified right you can you put a button and make it justified and uh, you know and you can put icon list you can put icon list to give the features and benefits to give the features and benefits uh, you can put this one here you can put icon list to give the features and benefits and you can cl click here to purchase this product all right so you can give this maybe you know maybe padding on all sides maybe 20 padding or maybe uh, let's say 50 padding on all sides Thirty padding on all sides and you can continue building your stuff you can give this a border radius so you can give this a border a solid border border type solid or you can give it one and give it black give it border radius of about maybe 50 do you understand look at that you're already building your own price table small small all right you just have to be you know you can you can use your creativity to build whatever it is you want to build i'm just telling you how to build this part this part of the website but i'm not going to build for you for now do you understand i'm not going to do that for you for now i believe you can use this as your assignment and your practice assignment so this should not be this should not be difficult for you that is what i'm saying from the lectures you have received so yeah but before we go there's one more thing that i want to show you let's update these changes let's update these changes and um, I'm going to show you something which is the last thing that we are going to talk about before we call this lecture a day and we'll go back on WhatsApp all right um, later today I'm going to send you um, some write-up something that I've already written up um, which contains exactly the step-by-step -step process that you can follow in order you get to, in order to get your first client do you understand um, but for you guys that you are already in the mentorship group don't worry all you have to do is go to module 8 do you understand what i'm going to send to you is just a summary it's just a summary of one of the lectures in module 8 all right so you guys that you've already got in the mentorship you are going to get the whole total full package 
of how to you know, actually nab your first clients. You know what? Let me share you a very good story. My WhatsApp is not loading. Let me just try and load up my WhatsApp. I want to share something very, very sweet to you guys. You know, there's a woman. She was part of class 49 or class 50. You know, she's a she's a university worker. She's a lecturer in a university. And for the past how many months now that ASU has been on strike, they've not been paid. Right? They've not been paid and she has been going through financial troubles, a lot of financial troubles. So she decided to enroll for Nova University and she started learning. She started learning, not up to two, three weeks ago. That was when she started learning. So she, I mean, she has been messaging me and I've been helping her. I've been very, very helpful to her because I really, really want to help her, you know, because I understand how hard it can be, you know, as a family person and um, they've not been paid for a lot of, for, for, a, for a very, uh, for, a, for a long time right now. So I really wanted to help her. And then we've been working together and just, I think yesterday or the day before yesterday, she messaged, she messaged me that she has already gotten her first potential client. That she has gotten her first potential client. That is less than two weeks, less than two weeks of consistency less than two weeks of consistency of following that master course right i already said i specifically told her let me okay let me show you now okay let me show you now uh, i think her name is mrs ajayi mrs ajayi nova university can you see mrs ajayi nova so if i open my chat and mrs ajayi nova for you right now it is still loading let me give it a while for for it to load right and I have another Mrs. Abudu, Mrs. Abudu, Nova University. This is Mrs. Abudu, Nova University as well. They are married women. These are married women in Nova University learning. These are married women. Married women. I don't. Know, I don't know what you, you as a, as a young person. I don't know why you would not commit yourself to learning. I don't know. All right. If I should, uh, if I should go to the very beginning of our. Of our, of our chat um, I don't know if I can go to the very beginning of our chat so that I can just I can just show you you know when she got started can you see this is 7th of 15th all right this is 7th of 15th all right this is 7th of 15th uh, you know after she has she has already enrolled she has already started learning and I gave her I think I gave her um, you know I gave her a a challenge that she should finish the course in two weeks and she took up the challenge all right and she took up the challenge you know she took up the challenge and and she has been very 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 consistent and i told her are you done with your master course the next thing for you to do is to create a portfolio and she said not yet she's not done but she's building her own website and she was wondering if she's going to take all the 72 courses and i said yes she should take everything when she's done share me the link and then we kept on going uh, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And she said, good morning, hello, Mr. Sam. Good morning, pardon my disturbance. You know I'm your number one cheerleader now, uh, but I'm cooking something, though. And by the time I'm done, I'm sure your cap, I'm sure you, I'm, I'm, sh I'm sure add feathers to your cap as my mentor. So um, we've been talking back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth like that. And she told me something. I think when was that? She told me something. When was that? Uh, okay, she said she's already finishing up her course. And then, um, okay, where was that? Where she told me that she got. Uh, uh, okay, hey, this is it. This is it. This is it. She said also I can leverage on her profession as a doctor to promote her business. Okay, this was when she told me that she already got. Um, she told me somewhere i don't know okay i think it was inside this vn where she told me that she already got a potential client she told me inside this vn that she already got a potential client and she said she needs to deliver the best for that person do you understand and she told me this on saturday that was last saturday and remember when i told you that she started 7th of 15 that is 15th this is okay 11th of this month she started 11th of this month can you see the date here? She started 11th of this month. This is the date here. That was when we started together. And right now, fast forward to last Saturday. She was already on her first client. Do you understand? And let me tell you, your first client is always the hardest for you to get. Once you get your first client, 
and you do the job and they like it they are the one that you will refer you to other people plus you yourself after you work for someone and they really like it, it will give you the confidence to go out and start you know looking for more jobs for yourself you know it will give you it will give you the the motivation it will give you the the courage you need to know that okay yes me too i'm working for clients right now and if you are already and if you are and if you are already a graphic designer and if you're already a graphic designer, um, you've already worked with people before. This shouldn't be very, very. This shouldn't be very, very hard for you. Do you understand? So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys have learned a lot in this class. All right. But before we go, there's something else that I want to show you. Um, let me exit out of this. All right. Let me exit out of this. Uh, let me exit out of this and i want to show you this real quick um, because I, I i want to make sure that i show you this before we part ways um please guys note um i think we still have about three slots left we still have about three slots left um those slots will expire tomorrow by 12 noon by 12 in the afternoon it will expire and it will no longer work again do you understand the price will go back to fifty thousand naira. If you want to join, you have to pay the fifty thousand naira right there. But I mean, this is not like a form of threat. Even if you are paying fifty thousand naira, it is way worth it. Do you understand? But I understand that maybe some of you you don't really have fund right now to enroll, which is totally fine. I really, really understand. But the point is that make sure you are dedicated. If you think this is, if you are thinking right now that this is good for you, and this is what you believe will work for you. I strongly believe that you can raise that money, you know, you can raise that money and you can enroll, right? If you enroll for something new and you learn something new under the right leadership, under the right mentorship, I mean, if you can learn this much from just a four days class, one hour per day, one hour per day, four days class, completely free, um, how, much volume, how much value can you foresee in the paid version of this class and how much, um, how much value are you foreseeing in the mentorship of someone that can give you this much value in a free class? Do you understand? Even if you are paying 100,000, 500,000, it is way more than worth it. Uh, all right. So, yeah, I just want to put that out there. So, let us create, let us open this about us section. Do you understand? Let us open this about us page. You can open any page you like, but I just want to show you something that will completely blow your mind. Right? I want to show you how you can create a complete website in less than two minutes. Two minutes, okay? in less than 30 seconds. I want to show you. I want to show you. So immediately after you open this, and this is the last thing we are going to do. Immediately after you open this, right? You can see that this is still having the sidebar. Why is he having sidebar? Who can remember? Who can remember why this guy is having sidebar? Who can remember why this guy is having sidebar? I explained this yesterday. I explained this yesterday. Who can remember why it is having sidebar? Come to the chat section and talk to me. Who can remember? Well, you can actually fix it from here. Come over here. Under page layout, select element of full width. Alright? Select element of full width. Do you understand? I told you guys that yesterday. Is either you go to the under the general settings or you know under the general page and go and select 100 percent full width or come here and select element of full width, full width do you understand so instead of going ahead and creating from scratch like that what i need you to do when you have a blank slate like this is to create click on this folder icon so after you click on this folder icon you are going to see you are going to see some pre-made templates some templates that has already been made for you you know pre-made templates although some of them are pro which you have to pay for but we have a lot of them that are free anyone that does not have pro on it is completely free like this one is free this one is free this one is free do you understand can you see can you see all this can you see all these beautifully made templates ready to go for you you can just select anyone all right you can select anyone you like do you understand but a lot of them are pro though but we can still see some of them that are free for example, the first one that I show you here, this first, this very first one is free. So you could just go ahead and click on, since we are dealing with about us, just click on insert. So when you click on insert, it will ask you to collect to templates library. Just click on get started. 
which means Elementor wants you to register with them before you start using their stuff. Pretty standard stuff. So it's very easy. So me, I already have an account on Biosam. I'm just going to click on connect but for you it will ask you to register just go ahead and register it is really quick it is really simple after you register and then you click on the register button it will take you here where you're going to connect all you have to do is to click on connect so after you click on connect it will redirect you to your website and then it will ask you apply this page settings to whatever whatever just click on apply Maybe after you click on apply it is already doing the magic in the background see the magic is already happening the magic is already happening guys the magic is already happening it is already downloading it make sure for this step you have to be connected to the internet because it is downloading it all right you have to be connected to the internet it is currently downloading it all right it is currently downloading it it is currently downloading it let's just give it a while let's give it a while let's give it a while it's currently downloading and boom do you see that do you see that guys do you see that can you see can you see you have an entire template an entire editable template that you can work with an entire editable template do you see that check this out an entire editable template that you can work with some of them used to come with pictures but this one does not come with picture which is all good because we can just insert our own pictures all right you can go ahead and change this from about us to um Big Sam is awesome, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, about us, keep it as about us. You can use this section to tell whatever it is you want to tell. Nova University is great. And immediately after you are done, you can click this. Anything you can edit any of this thing, change the color to whatever you want to, you know, change it to, change it to whatever you want to change it to, right? And then you can come to this image and insert any image you like there. Insert any image you like. Insert it there. Do you understand? You can continue to customize this to your liking, to whatever it is you want. Do you see? Service 1. You can change the image in this service 1 to whatever it is you like. You can change it to whatever it is you like. And you can, you know, instead of having service 1, you can say delivery. Sorry, delivery. All right, and then you can write a short description of that. You can customize this to anything you want. Do you understand? So go ahead and update your changes. Update your changes, and you can just go ahead and you know. And the thing is that it, this is not the only template we have. We have lots and lots of them here. You just have to look for the ones that are free. This one is free. This one is free. This one is free. This one is free. This is free. This is free. This is free. Do you understand if you scroll if you keep scrolling down you will see more that are free this is also free this is free this is free as well right this is free right this is also free this architectural stuff stuff is free you know, and keep scrolling down and keep seeing the one that are free and if you have money purchase elemental pro if you purchase elemental pro it is not expensive it's about i think it's about it's about 40 50 dollars or so just purchase it and you'll be able to have access to all these templates Right, you'll be able to have access to all these templates that you can import and use directly on the go. Right? If you if, if you see this home page, see how beautiful this home page is. Let me give you a preview of this. See how beautiful this home page is. But it is pro. That's the problem. If we imported this thing, we are going to have this entire page in front of us. We're not having to de design everything, anything. You are just going to edit whatever you need to edit and see you can deliver your website job in less than two days with this if someone gives you a website job just build them like maybe maybe 100k or 50k right you can deliver your website job in less than two days using templates do you understand you can and the beautiful thing what well, if you come to if you come to um if you come to google and you type <laughs> free elementor elementor templates for wordpress free elemental template for wordpress you will still see some people you know you will still see some people that can give you free elemental templates that you can download for free do you understand you can download for free that you can use see this one said 150 best free elemental templates that you can use do you understand this one said it will give you top 25 
25 free elemental templates and all that stuff so um it is so 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 super important for you to understand some of these things life is not hard right this is literally one of the most po powerful thing i have ever taught you in this class this right here that i teach you this template thing is one of the most powerful thing you will ever learn right so um i guess this will bring us to the end of this class all right this will bring us to the end of this class guys um thank you so much for staying to the end of our class and i'm going to be sending um that thing that i told you about about how you can go ahead and get your first clients i'm going to be sending it to our group right now so that you can check it out and remember the three slots that is remaining expires tomorrow by 12 o'clock all right so um thank you guys thank you so much everyone um i hope you have gotten value from this class i hope i have given you value i hope you have learned something new and i want you to go ahead and practice i want you to change your life with it i want you to change your earning capability with it and um god bless you so much all right so um we can take the rest to the group page the replay of this class is the replay of this class will be, i will compress it and i will upload it on my youtube channel and i will send it to you guys so god bless you a lot oh before we go i want you to do something for me oh, in fact don't worry don't worry don't worry about that don't worry about that all right uh, uh god bless you so much so let's take the rest to our whatsapp group. uh go and you know all these thank you big sam go and put it on our whatsapp group do you understand uh yeah all right thank you everyone Odavo. bye 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 guys how many of you want to see my face let me show you my face uh, let me show you my face before we go let me stop sharing hi everyone can you see my face all right all right everyone take care of yourselves for that ball enjoy the rest yeah, of i don't have like before. i can see your face too paul i can see your face <laughs> i can see Manuel as well Emmanuel. um sorry i don't want to pronounce your last name i don't want to mess it up again <laughs> all right i can see luatobi manuel Olabi as well you're doing well all right so bye everyone Richard Roslin, right, Richard Roslin is you. doing well as well. Uh, Olumide Omoni, uh, Noel Uka, Noel Uka is doing as well. Is doing well as well. All right, thank you everyone. God bless you. You can go ahead and save my number. You can greet me if you see me on the road. I'm a very friendly person. <laughs> All right. Uh, bye everyone. Good afternoon. Good That's the end of my class. How many have you had? Huh? How many have you had? How many have I had? Yeah, I had one yesterday. This one is which one?